fuck. Well, that was some sort of weird glitch. I had this Game Shark uh, guide from back in the day. It has like lots of Game Boy codes and stuff, like Pokemon and stuff. I don't know what the hell happened there. Uh, these are the two Metal Gear books that I showed off in the uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 video. It'll probably have come out by this point. Um, a Dreamcast guide, which I had back in the day. I used to be able to order stuff like this from the uh, like Scholastic uh, book thing that you ordered from or whatever. My copy of Ready Player One, my favorite book of all time. Check out the video for that. Um, I actually showed off Ready Player Two in, in a different thing over on my footstool there. This is my Scott Pilgrim, the colorized versions uh, collection there. Those are awesome. My original Pokemon uh, handbook from back in the day, which uh, has seen better, you know, it's seen better days, but it's not in the worst condition either. Um, and uh, I apparently used it at one point to checkmark stuff and whatever, but also, um, yeah, so it's, it's just really cool. Um, but it was a really cool little guide. I remember having the Johto one, which is like super rare now, and I can't fucking find it anymore. I traded it to my friend Mayab, and I don't know what the hell he did with it, but and I had the green one of this too, which was like an updated one at some point. It had like Mew and Togepi and stuff. Um, don't have that anymore, apparently. Otherwise, it'd be sitting out here, probably. But it's just cool to show off. Um, I have this weird pokemon like off-brand guide or something it's super strange uh, that i bought a disc replay there's uh the Mega Man comics and uh some of my spider gwen comics and stuff why did i i, I don't know why i went that way with it um my life is strange comic uh oh not there um here life is strange comic which i need to read the rest of this uh is the official nintendo players guide which i have a second copy of there but What's cool about this version of the Nintendo Player's Guide, uh, you can see their Pro Jared signed it. Not not the coolest of the signatures that I have, but um, it is signed by like most of my YouTube uh, people who I love. Like Gerard's there. There's Rue from Clan of the Green Wolf, if you guys remember that. Uh, Peanut Butter Gamer. Peanut Butter Gamer uh, is there. John Hancock and uh, Norm, you know, the gaming story and Pat signed it um derek signed it here somewhere i don't remember where he signed it but i have a picture with him as well so um jason heine and just a whole bunch of other people metal jesus there um yeah so this is really special to me because this is uh i got like so many people to sign this uh that are like idols of mine uh youtube wise uh that really inspired my channel and whatnot. Okay, this is going to be hard to get these back here with one hand. But anyway, so that's really cool. Um, my Overwatch uh, comic collection, uh, you know, the bound together, the, what do you call it? Uh, anthology <laughs> volume or whatever the fuck you want to call it. Uh, there, which is really cool. There's my annotated Alice, uh, Alice in Wonderland, one of like, my favorite, you know, uh, books and movies and all that. All right, so down here we have more just like Nintendo guides and stuff. Here, I'll kind of get a wide pan of that. Um, here's all my Mario guides. This, this beat up one here is actually my uh, Super Mario World guide from back in the day. I, I'm not gonna pull it out because it's um, it's hard to pull all these out. Anyway, um, the Banjo Kazooie and Diddy Kong Racing uh, guides. I actually have two guides for Mario Party Two here. Um, this one. And this one, this is this is why I don't want to pull too many of these out because uh, they will, uh, they, they like, they get really, uh, they get really out of place when I start pulling them out because there's so many of them. Um, all right, here we go. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to pull too many of those, the rest of these out. Uh, the Mega Man Battle Network guides, the Golden Sun guide, that's a really cool one. Um, that's a, this is where all my Pokemon guides are. That, that one that you can't really tell is like, uh, where is it? Pokemon Yellow, um, Special Edition, uh, Pokemon Gold Silver. You got all the Pokemon guides here pretty much, um, which are really helpful up until, uh, Sword and Shield. And the only, the only one that didn't like, it just didn't really fit. So I just kind of put it down there. 
Um, I got a bunch of gaming magazines here. I can pull them out. Um, this one is the one that, uh, actually I mentioned this in a video where um, it's like a Metal Gear Solid 4, the reveal of that. This one also has something like that in it. Um, these are those retro video game gamer magazine, which, uh, yeah, uh, I never got the first one, so I don't even have a, like a complete set of those. And then it uh, becomes Nintendo Powers. Um, there's like a Super Game Boy one here, and the Top Secret Passwords. I have a, another copy of the, the the guide there. This one was mostly just for the signatures and whatnot. Um, I'll never forget uh, when Pat signed the player's guide here. Uh, he did it in the Pat. He, he, he like, one of the first things he said to me, he's like, oh, you got the player's guide. He said it in the Pat voice, and I just was, I was like, oh my god, that's so funny. I, I don't know why that was funny to me, but it really was. So I have, like, most of the issues from 1 to 50 of Nintendo Power. Um, that was kind of my goal, is just to get, like, the first 50, because that was, like, the NES run. Um, so I would always have, like, the, the games for the NES, you know, all that, um, that I could refer to the, the Nintendo Powers for. And I have some, um, actually, the ones with the pictures... Over here are the ones that I had from my childhood. So it's like how I figured out about Golden Sun and stuff um, from back in the day. So they're really nostalgic to look through. That's actually how I know about um, Final Fantasy Tactics is some of these ones. Uh, it's actually this this one right here. And I have uh, a nicer version, I believe, of that somewhere. That, that same one. Um, yeah, and then I have some Nintendo Power guides here at the end, like the Super Mario 64 one, the Golden Eye one, the Perfect Dark one. Uh, and then this is the Nintendo Power Index, which is like $20 for this fucking shit. I don't understand why the fuck that was, but I paid for it. Whatever. Who cares? Um, so yeah, that's like my guides in this, this section. Uh, I guess I'll show this off since we're kind of, um, you know, like not, there's not a lot going uh, for time on this one. I have this is like my little batteries you put in the Game Boy games and that kind of stuff. I always have extras of those. My PS3 manual from back in the day. Um, you know, like stuff to take apart the games and whatnot. Well, Dragon Quest XI, little pre-order bonus there. Um, this is one of those game bits to take apart like Nintendo games and like all, mostly Nintendo stuff. Uh, I don't know, I have some knives in here that's in there. Like, uh, I think uh, we used this for, like, our Resident Evil, like, like uh, the, the movie that we were making back in the day or something. This is, like, my pocket knife from when I was a kid uh, from, like, Boy Scouts or whatever. Um, okay, and then so in here, why I wanted to get into here is because this stuff is all, this is, like, my Mega Man Battle Network 3 guide. This is, like, the ones I printed off back in the day. So it's just funny because a lot of these are still really good guides. Like, these are... Dragon Quest guides down here and stuff. Um, and then, let's see, below all of this, I know I've got even more stuff. Uh, this is like, what is this? Okay, hold on. This is, oh yeah, more Dragon Quest guides, and I have some like maps and stuff down here, you know, like half printed in. These are all like old Game Pass guides. This is actually stuff from my original Dragon Quest Eight guide that like fell out and stuff. That's that's pretty funny. Um, so yeah, that's all over here. So that's all really nostalgic to like look at uh, this stuff because you know it's all from back in the day. Um, I have my game guide. Uh, I'm not gonna go through all of these, but I have my game guide or a game manual um, box for just like my loose manuals and stuff. Especially for like NES games and stuff. This is actually, wow, holy shit. This is actually my original uh, Sonic Adventure manual from back in the day and stuff. Uh, so that's pretty cool. I don't have the game of mine from back in the day. Uh, my original Jurassic Park. I don't know where the fuck the game went, but that's funny that it has uh, that on the back because I also had that game as well. Um, Dragon Traveler, or Dungeon Trout, Dungeon Travelers 2, which is a, a Vita game that was like supposed to be sh super short printed or something. Uh, you get like the fucking, you know, waifus in there or whatever. I don't know. Um, these are a bunch of like NES 
manuals and stuff. So I'm not gonna go through all of them, like I said, but there's like, yeah, like a Morrowind, just on the side kind of thing. This is for that Charmander plush, actually. That's pretty cool. Um, a Dragon Warrior, like the the one that came with the box and all that. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, a bunch of these kind of guides. Um, there, see, this is what's fucked is I still have my manuals for uh, for all of the old games, but I don't have my old games anymore. So I have my, like my original Spyro manual. And uh, by the way, in case you didn't know, uh, where is it? There's a code that I used to fucking get my friends with. All of this. Uh, oh yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. These are shit we wrote back, wrote down back in the day. Um, where's the code at? I'm trying to figure that out. Um, do, do, do. But there's a code in here where you just kind of uh, you can you get a you can unlock. Here it is. You can unlock a, a special demo for Crash uh, Warped and. I remember blowing my friends' minds with that back in the day. This is my original Metal Gear Solid guide, uh, which is pretty funny. So, yeah, bunch of uh, original Pokemon, uh, red and blue guide, and uh, my original gold and silver guide, which I don't have the boxes for anymore. Actually, I have the box for red and blue. Uh, I have a bunch of, oh, oh yeah, yeah, here we go. This is um, actually from the uh, Dragon Warrior Monsters 2. I still have the the uh, the box and stuff for that. I just don't have my original game for that, I don't believe. This is cool, a little poster for that, or whatever that came with the box. Um, Super Mario RPG Guide, um, or manual. Harvest Moon Manual, which is like five bucks. Like, who the fuck wouldn't buy that? This is awesome. Um, Dragon Quest Eight, like a uh, manual. A lot of these were in the manual thing at Disc Replay, which was like twenty five cents each. So I just bought every single one of them. Cause like people, I guess, brought in their manuals without bringing in like the games or whatever, or like even with the games, like they're not gonna sell them together sometimes or whatever. Um, another one I have is this uh, Metal Gear Solid manual. It's stuck to something, but the manual itself is actually pretty, you know, valuable too. Um, but that was from back in the day. Um, Super Mario Bros. Yeah, most of these. That, that one is from back in the day. Also, so is that. Um, but a lot of these are just like I bought them like later on. Um, anything that I haven't specified, basically. Um, this, I mean, this doesn't mean a lot to a lot of people, but this is actually the original back to my first Game Boy, which is my first system of Game Boy Color. Um, but I don't have the system anymore. I think somebody stole it or something back in the day. So, um, which sucks, you know, because that was like one of my most nostalgic things. These are my Amiibo cards. Actually, I see something that I'm really anxious to look at. Um, oh, we don't need to see that. Um, this is my original, <laughs> you can tell, this is my original uh, Dragon Warrior 1 and 2 um, you know, manual. Uh, for, and I still have the box there too. Actually, this is my original manual of this as well. I showed that in, in one of the other videos. Um, and this. And this. All these manuals are original. And I have most of these boxes still. Even if I don't have the games. Uh, actually, I have most of these games. This is my original Gold Sun manual. My original Four Swords manual. My original uh, Battle Network manual. Of course, my original Battle Network 3 manual. Uh, my Rayman 3 manual. And then I didn't have a game back in the day, but yeah, so that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, um, and then most of these other things aren't that super interesting, but uh, here's an extra, like, uh, there's one, two, I didn't even realize I had these in here. But they're extra, like, uh, what you call them, uh, backs for my PSP. Um, this, I don't know if that relevant to video games or not. Uh, this is my old Game Boy Advance. I didn't think I was gonna be showing this thing off because I kind of forgot about it honestly. That uh, was one of my originals and as you can see, boom, I punched the screen because I couldn't catch ho -Oh or whatever uh, and I got really mad and punched the screen. And what's funny is this still works. See? Still works. Um, I actually used this um, instead of buying 
another Game Boy Advance SP. I actually used this to transfer Pokemon up in uh, Pokemon Generation 3. So it still works. It's still functional. But uh, yeah, so that's just really funny. Um, I don't think any of the rest of that's very relevant to video games. So this is kind of my junk drawer. Not really a junk drawer, but like a lot of video game related stuff in here. Um, what's this? Oh, yeah, that's not. Okay. Um, I have like my copy of Fable with the PC in here and uh, my demo discs, which, uh, man, they should really have a better place than this, honestly. I need to like display these somehow or something. But, um, because those are super important to me. My, uh, oh yeah, my OG e-reader that I, that I bought back in the day. Um, should, that shouldn't even be in here. I don't know why that's in here. Oh, uh, this is like a, what is this? I don't know what this is. Some kind of skirt adapter thing. Um, yeah, there's, there's not like a lot to talk. Oh, this is Dragon Quest, or Dragon Quest, Dragon uh, Knight card. I like Dragon Knight. These are some random like mishmash, like I don't have the cases for on like Bugs Life and I don't even know I don't even know if that would work, that Bugs Life. I haven't even played that. Um yeah, some like demo discs I had from back in the day. Actually I remember oh my god, I remember this one because look, it actually has medieval on it, which I reviewed uh more recently. Uh, I should take a look at this one again. Actually, that's pretty interesting. Um my one of my many many copies of physical copies of Metal Gear uh, that broke at some point or something like I don't know. Um, my oh shit, there's another. I don't even know which one's the original anymore. Then there's another e-reader in here. I remember buying this uh, along with some Amiibo cards. I'll show off here in a bit. Uh, yeah, this Metal Gear is just like totally dismantled. This is uh my Renegade Squadron, which uh, came with my PSP because it was the Darth Vader edition. Uh, not that I can show that off because uh, Mayab knows why. So, yeah. Um, hey Ocean. Is that Hey Ocean? Oh my god. Yep, it's Hey Ocean. If you know what that is, you know what that is. So, um, so yeah. I don't know. Just a bunch of that kind of stuff in this drawer. Um... Bunch of wires and splitters and stuff in this drawer. Oh, gotta move these manuals, otherwise they're gonna get crushed. All right, and a bunch of extra stuff in this drawer. That's a bunch of cords and whatnot. I got my hog pog in here. And I got my Rob uh, uh, stack up thing that I have part of and extra Nintendo case and stuff. Just some stuff like that in there. So that's pretty cool. Um, I guess that's it for this part. And then we'll show off this uh, the rest of that stuff in the next part or whatnot. So 